And y'all know we love food, fun, and fashion on our show. Our whole focus has been to find designers with original ideas, a very gallery museum approach to accessories. One of our designers we're featuring is Simone Sabag. Very sculptural, very detailed. You get the big, bold look with a very light weight. The whole concept behind Simone Sabag is to give you comfort style with a push and punch toward color. Simone is a mechanical engineer and came up with a process 30 years ago of carving wax molds that are bold and sculptural and forming a technique of sterling over the wax. So you are getting a sterling piece, but you're getting the big bold look at a very lightweight um, bonus. Here in Atlanta, uh, we are the best selling jewelry line at the High Museum gift shop. Um, we're there, she plays up the very sculptural art side of the design. Next, we take a look at Silver with a Message. Uh, this is GeoArt by Cynthia Gale. Cynthia Gale, the artist, was your typical art student struggling to get through her education. Um, she actually modeled in New York. Funny enough, she loves to tell the story how that she lived on bread and water till she graduated, worked six months with Andrea Jovine, got a modeling contract that took her to, from Paris to Milan to Jakarta in Indonesia. Being the bohemian that Cynthia Gale is, she fell in love with Jakarta and actually lived with a family who had a jewelry factory for two and a half years. It was there she learned to do sketches uh, for the factory and led to her becoming the jewelry designer that she is today. The Indonesian consulate had actually awarded Cynthia at the uh, New York conference an award for single-handedly reviving the ancient art of repose uh, in their country. It's a technique that takes 10 years to perfect and it's basically in a simplified term the carving of a wooden mold, a reverse carving, and then hammering of thin sheets of sterling to create this relief process that you see today. Uh, liquid metal is a line that covers all the categories the ladies needs, from the denim jeans to the bracelets to the rings. Liquid metal gives you a very edgy look, a very fluid look as we see in the bracelets. It's almost like metal that's been woven or laced together so it contours as a ring or as a bracelet on the hand. And the nice thing about the ring is it is the woven metal, so it's very fluid on the hand. There's no stiff shank coming down the side, which can cause a discomfort. Uh, with an assortment of stones from tanzanite to light amethyst to um, emerald, as well as the clear CZ. And we finish off with the uh, handbag that can be a fun um, out on the town, white blouse and jeans to an evening look. Very fluid uh, mixing of metal and denim in the jean. And he solves the problem of coordinating your belt, your handbag, and your jewelry all together in one fatal swoop. You guys may be familiar with Dory Sinjari from a lot of editorials. Uh, we've been um, in everything from Vogue to InStyle to Lucky Magazine. Um, she takes uh, something as simple as a spool of soutache and weaves, twists, sews with stones and antique glass to create a very lightweight, very wearable art piece of jewelry. And as you can see from looking at her jewelry line today, the uh, strength of the amethyst color, the olives for fall, the chocolate browns, she really touches on each of that in the jewelry that she uh, creates for fall of eight. It's truly a conversation piece for ladies too when they go out to dinner or a cocktail party. It's a good way to start the conversation. You can also take a very simple outfit and really bring it to life with Dory Sinjari. The next line we would like to present to you is Andrew Hamilton Crawford. Uh, it's a new line to the Southeast. Um, these two gentlemen are from New York and work primarily with resin set in sterling with a rhodium plate or a 24 karat gold plate. This has been a very strong feature of Henry Bendel's in New York for the last two years. Uh, it's also been one of Oprah's favorite picks with the uh, wide cuff bracelets, which she's worn on the show and mentioned in O Magazine. It's also a part of the line that Patricia Fields, who does a lot of styling from Sex and the City to many other movies in Hollywood, has dubbed the It line for 08. Uh, they also move from resin into fun fashion earrings, as you see in the uh, butterfly earrings, uh, the two wings, which we also do the single wing as a necklace. Another favorite trend of theirs is freeform with sterling wire. 
Uh, we offer everything from the uh, peace earring to the uh, love heart and some of just the open free forms, which we do both in sterling or 24 karat gold plate. This is truly the type of jewelry that you can put on and wear with your real um, jewelry and feel as if it's a part of your fine jewelry collection. Andrew Crawford Hamilton stretches from your country club classics with the enamels to the uh, fun high street fashion of the peel necklace or the stiletto necklace.